We first told you about the so-called zombie drug this summer with officials in Sacramento and Butte County warning it would soon become more prevalent. Well, tonight we're hearing from an undercover detective about the dangers of the drug. It's a very potent and very deadly drug to get their hands on and a very small amount can do very great harm to many people. The first cases of xylazine are being detected all across the nation from Florida to right here in California. The information we received is that this, this drug is in 48 of our states. Found in pills, powder, and needles, xylazine, a horse tranquilizer known as Trank, is the new deadly drug. You've heard of fentanyl being found in all other narcotics to cut them. Well, Trank is now being cut with fentanyl. Xylazine is nicknamed Trank because of the zombie-like effects it gives users, eating them alive. Mainly what we're seeing is the side effects uh, include um, basically very bad lesions of the skin that will lead to amputations later down the road. And that's something that we have not seen with any with any other drug that we've come across. Butte County found it by testing people in their rehabilitation program. One case in June and two in July. But since the ability to test just became available to them in April, there is most likely more out there. Both Butte County and the Sacramento County District Attorney's Crime Lab are predicting Trank will become more prevalent. We are just now starting to see it. We've had a handful of cases. The individual was actively seeking xylazine from his dealer. Uh, the other two didn't didn't know that xylazine was in their system. It was it was just it was shocked them. They're like, "What is this? And how did it get in the system?" So even street drug users aren't necessarily aware it's it's in the drug supply. They've seen it coming from miles away. The West Coast follows East Coast trends, and when you look across the U.S., ninety percent of their street drug supply is contaminated with xylazine. So it has just marched progressively across the, the country and now it's here in California. I hope that we can put it into it and maybe hope that we can find out what works when people overdose so we can help them more because right now um, when they overdose, we can't help them. A widespread threat with no cure if someone ODs. Narcan does not help. Narcan only helps with opiates, so it would only affect the fentanyl. Again, there is no medication to bring someone back from a xylazine or zombie drug overdose. And that's why officials are sounding the alarm now, hoping to save lives.